Hi guys, welcome back to another vlog from Dubai. I got back home last night and let's just say I am a bit jet lagged from being in Europe for all in all a whole month actually. Not feeling the best, really really tired, but we do have an L appointment today so as I told you guys, I was in Europe for a whole month and I didn't do my nails while I was there. So they are so outgrown and disgusting to a point where I need to rush. So I actually got an invitation from... Let me put you guys down. I was invited to go to this new open salon in Dubai Mall. I think it's originally from the UK. But they are just currently inviting a bunch of influencers to go there, try it out, and then obviously if we like it, we can share. I've had a French manicure for two months now, and I am so bored, so I think today I'm going to go for a pop of color. Preferably turquoise, like that's what I'm imagining. If they have the right shade of turquoise, that would be amazing, because I am very specific about the shades. So... I'm gonna try get that and yeah, just kind of browse in Dubai Mall. There's one thing I want to look at in Cartier. Actually, there's a size issue that I've had with one of their items. So I'm gonna go there and yeah, just generally chill and then Philip might join me later. But let me show you guys what I'm wearing because my outfit is really cute and chic but very simple. My bodysuit is this Fits Everybody from Skims. I am obsessed with Skims lately. I literally shop there once a week. I know, very toxic. And then my denim are from a thrift store. I got them like two years ago, but they were always too small for me. So I've just lost a bit of weight over the past six months and they finally fit perfect. So they are originally from Calvin Klein, as you can see back there. And then my little brown belt is also from a thrift store. I got it this time in Stockholm. Let's just say I was thrifting in Stockholm. I am obsessed with thrifting and I definitely did pick up a bunch of pieces while I was there. So I'm really happy and excited about that. And yeah, let's just put on our bag and pack it down with lip products, cards, keys, everything, and then head off to Dubai Mall and get our nails done. Actually, pedicure as well. I'm booked in for a mani and pedi. So I'll see you guys in the mall. Can we also take a moment for how fluffy my hair is? It's giving Diana one year ago when I was blonde, I was super like, fluffy but i just blowed out my hair last night went to bed and i woke up and it's giving okay dubai is so cloudy today what's going on okay guys we found it we made it it's right here in the corner Let's see hello hi, hi. hi. yeah how are you today? i'm good how are you oh my god how beautiful is it here Okay, I'm done at We Nailed It and I got these turquoise manis, which wow, the color is insane. It's screaming summer, it's screaming good vibes, so I'm really happy. I feel like this place is perfect if you're in Dubai Mall and you just want to spoil yourself. It was such a beautiful place and they had so many colors and the manicure generally is really, really good, so I'm happy. I now need to run to a restroom and pee because I'm about to pee myself. I also want to check out Cartier, which is right there. So that's perfect. Like how much vibes are these? I have ordered four macarons as a little snack. It's so pretty here. I love this lottery. It's right in the middle of Fashion Avenue as well. So it's perfect if you're shopping and you're a bit hungry, you just want to grab a little snack. Look who just arrived. My baby came all the way from work and he's like, Dan, are you eating macarons by yourself? You know, my work <laughs> has been uh, calling me out for like gaining so much weight over Christmas. Really? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know how hungry I am? Like, I'm shaking. I cooked lunch at home and then I didn't even eat it. Okay, I that's didn't weird. Even, well, yeah, you, didn't, you didn't even try it? Come here. You didn't, I didn't try it because I was like rushing to get to my nail appointment. What do you think? Yeah, the color is beautiful. I right? love it. You love baby blue. It's These something are like medium. turquoise. Baby Shall blue. we? I want to start with pistachio. So excited. I haven't had these in so long. 
This is my favorite. Mm. Wait, that's mm, vanilla. This is raspberry and this is coffee. Mm. Good. Okay, I'm gonna go for the coffee. Oh. Literally, try. you gotta eat it, it's so expensive. <laughs> I'm try the coffee one. It was really coffee. I like coffee. Babe, well, you know why I didn't order a coffee? Because mm. I've been into Cartier, I've been into Rolex, I've been into different stores, and every time I go anywhere, they bring me a coffee. That's nice. But yeah. Yeah, no more coffee. Now. Yeah, no more coffee. He's like, do you not want a coffee with your macarons? I'm like, no, thank you. Okay, coffee was so good. Mm -hmm. I like that one more than the pistachio. No, we'll not me. this in a seven and a half. The vanilla. Eight raspberry one seven and a half. Fair. We're back home and I am going to be warming up the lunch that I cooked today. So we have baked chicken and then fried potatoes. So I'm just gonna heat up almost all of it because me and Philip are both so hungry. I've spent so many hours and I'm really tired but this is what we're looking at everything is just much more organized and neat and I've also gotten rid of a bunch of things even fixed my shoes I mean I don't have a lot of space but this is what we're working with we've even color coordinated these are all abayas in here I've put all of my kind of like bodysuits skin bodysuits and just kind of like sleeker tops um, even some shapewear and just here we have my pants, my jeans, some skirts. These are underwear, that's gym wear, and then that's just kind of like home wear, which is not a lot, but I got rid of so many things and it feels amazing. I feel really good, however, the room is a mess, but I'm just gonna tidy up all of this and then we're pretty much done. I have even organized my jewelry, so I'm gonna show you guys how satisfying it looks now that everything is neatly put in place so as you can see here i have all my earrings these are mostly vintage earrings we've got some rings we've got my cartier bracelets and watches and then underneath here we just got a bunch of random things so we've got more watches jewelry cleaner random earrings you guys let me know if you would be interested in me filming a full jewelry collection I'm starting to love my jewelry collection i think i have such nice pieces so you comment down below if that would be interesting it is a bit later now and i have pinned up my hair i'm getting ready because i am going to abu dhabi tonight with two of my friends i'm invited to this cap on the slash sephora after party event at a beach club in abu dhabi really really excited to go to abu dhabi because it's my first time ever i've been wanting to go there for a long time but ever since i moved to dubai you've had to have a pcr to enter abu dhabi but now they've stopped with this so you can just casually go there and come back to Dubai for the night. Obviously not going to be able to experience Abu Dhabi like actually, but I'm going to make sure me and Philip goes there shortly. It's just one and a half hour drive, so that's really, really good. We're going to go there. It starts at 7 p.m. So I'm just getting ready now in time. It's around 
3.30 right now. I'm gonna go in with the best bronzer in the whole entire world. It's this one in the color Tan Deep Bronze. I love this product so much. And the hack to it looking amazing is you take the product with your fingers, kind of like warm it up, and then you put it on the back of your hand like that. And then you go in with a foundation brush and you just kind of like pat it in, like push the product into the skin. It looks amazing and it sits so pretty. Kind of like a dewy look if you guys are into like dewy makeup, not too matte. I don't like matte bronzers too much, so I've been loving to do this. I'm not the type of person who does like New Year's resolutions. I just generally always try to be a better person and like upgrade my life. But one thing that I really thought about for 2023 is I want to actually start enjoying Dubai more. You guys might be thinking that you're already doing so many things, what are you talking about? But honestly guys, I've just had a bit of a hard time recently with like being social with people. I find it hard, I find it difficult, I just kind of want to be in my own comfortable space. But I decided that I'm gonna have to say yes to more things. The only reason to this is I have started to think about moving back to Sweden. Not yet, but if I do anytime soon, I don't want to leave Dubai and think, wait, why did I not do that? Like there's so many things to do here, but I feel like when you live in Dubai, you take a lot of these things for granted. So like, for example, going to Abu Dhabi, just like that on an event. Like I would never do that before, but now I'm like, even if it's shit, like I just ended up seeing my friends and dressing up. Literally from now on, I just want to laugh. I just want to have fun. So done with being alone and overthinking and having anxiety. Like I just want to have fun and laugh my way through 2023. Well, one time I had a good time and I regretted having a good time. You know what I mean? But there's so many times I end up saying no to things and I'm by myself in the apartment. Like, why did I do that? I literally am 20 fucking five years old saying no to things because what i'm anxious i live too much in my brain Halas. no more of that you know what my alter ego is called jolene and my friend emmy told me this in stockholm she was like diana you have an alter ego and she's giving jolene vibes always dresses up she's just living her best life like she's young and free and i was like hold up like i'm gonna enter my jolene era i really loved when she said that because it kind of entered my mind in a different way and I was like I need to create an alter ego for myself that's kind of like the highest version of Diana who is the highest version of Diana her name is Jolene clearly like she is just fierce like she doesn't give a shit about anything like she's just there to have a good time and if there's bad vibes she just leaves that's Jolene for me anyway so <laughs> make sure you have an alter ego her name is gonna be something fierce and you just enter her whenever you're like getting a bit anxious you're like oh, stop, stop. no i'm not dealing with this 2023 is only good vibes so the makeup is fully done i just need to take out these pins now and put on my fragrance get dressed and we are ready to go i have about 30 minutes <laughs> Oh my god. I'm gonna brush it out, put some Jisoo oil. This is the hair currently. It's a bit much, I feel like, but it will definitely lay throughout the night. So, this is what we're looking at. I just put some oil in it. I'm trying to brush it, but like it's not changing. It's kind of annoying me. I just need to figure out my parting, but then I think it. By the way, going dark was probably the best decision I could have ever done in this age. Not necessarily because I didn't like the blonde, but just because I feel like the dark, it just kind of brings out the Middle Eastern features differently. Like you look like a woman and it's just, it looks really fresh and much more healthy, I would say, than blonde because blonde is kind of reflecting the light in a different way where it kind of makes it look a bit like uh, dry. I mean, it is dry, but you know what I mean. So I am so happy I dared to go dark because it was definitely a very scary decision. Let's go and figure out an outfit now. This is gonna be the outfit of the night. The reason being, first of all, it's really cold, so I have to wear a long sleeve. And then the skirt is very beachy. And as it is on a beach club, I think there's no other option better than this. So this is all in all what it looks like. The top is White Fox Boutique. The skirt is Massimo Dutti. The heels are Zara bag is Jackmoose from Farfetch. My hair looks so much better now as well. So um, do I love the outfit? No. Does it work? 
absolutely guys we have made it to abu dhabi how stunning is this place honestly it looks amazing i'm gonna go and find out where the event is it's so pretty in here so hi girls these are my swedish friends you guys have met them before cutie I feel like my outfit goes really well with this lobby and like aesthetic of the place It's kind of giving Kim Kardashian's house actually Like the high ceilings This insane door, imagine having it in your house Something else, I would love that Looks like it's only us and a few people Which is kind of <laughs> embarrassing like coming all the way from Dubai to this <laughs> That's because we're Swedish, we're always on time Yeah, true. Yeah, that's it's true <laughs> But it's amazingly gorgeous yeah, here. Wow, you guys, look around. So it's a beach club, but they're throwing like an after party here. So beautiful. guys I am on my way <laughs> they're all staring at me on my way to Playa Beach Club today I have been to Pilates this morning I've had breakfast gone home showered now on my way so I feel like it's already a very very good day and this is what we're wearing for the beach club today this beach club is called Playa and it's on the Palm Jumeirah it's amazing I've been there two times before I really really enjoyed it the food is so good you guys I will show you when we eat going with the same friends that I went to the event at Abu Dhabi last night I feel like it was really kind of not worth it going all the way there but I'm still definitely living my Jolene era so we're not unhappy for that we're gonna go to the beach club today <laughs> Yeah. You want a magnum because one one bottle is just 45 yeah. glasses only. So you can. Oh my god. What is it? Mm. How is it? Yeah? There is secret inside here, you know? Secret? Yeah. Very I secret. think I might have ate it. <laughs> <laughs> What's the secret? Where yeah, is just it? Just try it first and after that you will know. Okay. What? Uh, I'm so curious. Where is the secret? In my stomach. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> you have to check it then. <laughs> Mm. Mm, I, I like personally because I love chocolate. I will say the fondant. So this is really fresh. Exactly, you know the bum bum cream. 
bum bum. Oh yeah, the yeah, bum bum. but the orange one. This one tastes like the bum bum cream, guys. So de Janeiro. <laughs> I am back home, you guys. Today was such a nice day. I was just eating good food, hanging out with my friends, taking a swim. I was even napping at one point. I mean, today is just amazing. Even met some of you guys. Like while I was eating, some subscribers came up to me and greeted me, and you were so fun, like amazing, like giving me compliments, being so funny, and just. 10 out of 10. Love when you guys come up to me. But yeah, today was just such a good day. I am back home, as I said. It is like 5.30 right now, so sun is about to set. I am going to be hopping into the shower. I feel so disgusting, like my hair is so jelly. <laughs> that means like I've got a lot of gel in it. Jelly. I'm gonna like oh, really refresh and spend the evening in the apartment cooking. Philip's gonna come home, we're gonna hang out. And I'm going to be stopping the vlog here. I, oh, did I even tell you where my outfit is from? This huge shirt is from White Fox. You guys have probably seen it if you've watched my latest try on haul. It's amazing. And I actually have a discount code on White Fox. It's Diana, not sponsored or anything. Hello, focus, thank you. And then my bikini is also White Fox, actually. Amazing. And then these pants are Zara. Thank you for being here. Thank you for watching me. And thank you for letting me do what I love to do. I love you guys so much. And take care. Bye.